Hello everyone, how to simplify this nice algebraic expression? So if we have 8 to the power of 14 multiplied by 5 to the power of 40. So we write this into the simplified form. So uh, here uh, we cannot have any rule in which uh, you can just multiply the different bases and uh, different exponents uh, numbers. Okay, so you see that bases on both of these numbers are different but exponents are also different. So here we have no rule to multiply this type of number so that here we need some working uh, to uh, convert this into the uh, in, into that form in which we can apply the uh, apply any exponent rule okay so that now here uh, some students makes the uh, some student make some common mistakes uh, so some students just do this type of question in this way uh, uh, that students are just right uh, he can just multiply the uh, basis and he can just multiply the exponents in this way okay so this is a times of 5 is 40 and when you multiply these two numbers then you get any number okay so uh, some students make this type of common mistake but this is the wrong solution and now here i will just tell us tell you that uh, the correct way to solve this problem okay so here first uh, you need to uh, uh, you need to write the base of this term into the prime factor form you will know that a 8 is equals to 2 cubed okay so now here we write this 8 equals to 2 cubed so that our given expression will be written as 2 cubed and its exponent is 4 multiplied by 5 to the power of 40 okay so further you see here uh, we need to multiply these two exponents by using this exponential law we know that if you have a to the power of m to the power of n it is equals to a to the power of m times of n so here we apply this nice exponential law in the first term so that our first term will be written as uh, so we write it as 2 to the power of 3 times of 14 multiplied by 5 to the power of 40 okay so here you see that uh, 3 times of 14 uh, will be equals to uh, uh, 42 because 3 times of 14 becomes here 42 and it is multiplied by 5 to the power of 40 so here after this step we need to again rewrite this expression so we have 2 to the power of 42 and now we break this uh, exponent and we write this 42 as 40 plus 2 and it is multiplied by 5 to the power of 40 okay so after this step here we need uh, an other exponential law so we apply here if you have a to the power of m plus n it is equals to a to the power of m multiplied by a to the power of n so now here we apply this nice rule uh, in the first term so that our first term will be written as 2 to the power of 40 multiplied by 2 to the power of 2 and this is also multiplied by 5 to the power of 40. So here we need another rule uh, and you know that if we have a to the power of m multiplied by b to the power of n so here you see that its bases are uh, bases are different sorry this is also m bases are different but exponents are same so we combine these exponents and it will be written as a multiplied by b and its whole power is m so here we need uh, this nice rule so according to this nice rule we uh, need to combine mm, the bases whose exponents are same okay so you see that the exponent of 2 is 40 exponent of 5 is also 40 so we combine these two numbers and we write it as so here you see that we have 2 to the power of 2 so 2 to the power of 2 equals to 4 multiplied by we combine these two numbers and we write it as 2 times of 5 and its exponent is 40 okay so further you see here uh, we have this is 4 multiplied by 2 times of 5 becomes here 10 and its exponent is 40 so uh, this is the our final simplified form of the given question 
and uh, thank you so much for watching this video please subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos